Hey, what's going on, guys? Ravi here from Mirai FX, along with Mr. Zebo. Welcome you to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. So, in this video, we'll be learning to make this spin transition effect in a very simple way. So, without any delay, let's get started. Alright, so I have two videos in my project here. Let me select both of them and drag these to the right side panel here so that a sequence is created. Let me actually remove this audio to one of the video here just so that it's quite clear to us. So we'll have to create a spin transition between these two videos. So in order to do that, right click here and create a new item called adjustment layer. Click OK. And drag this adjustment layer between these two videos just like this let me zoom in a bit just so that it's quite clear to us so go to the frame between these two videos exactly here and move four frames forward by uh, tapping on the right arrow key so one two three four here and uh, simply move this uh, cut this video here and also go four frames to the left one two three and four and uh, Cut the adjustment layer just like this Once you're done with this we'll have to add some uh, effects onto our adjustment layer So go to the effects panel and simply type Transform you have this transform effect in the distort folder here and drag this onto the adjustment layer just like this so now you see that there's this transform effects here and the first thing that you'll have to do is increase the scale value to um, greater than 200 around 220 looks good to me all right and then uh, you'll have to click on this timer button here for the rotation at the first frame of uh, of the adjustment layer and also go to the last frame of the adjustment layer and change the rotation value to 360 degrees so what actually happens now is this adjustment layer you know creates a spin just like this and we actually increase the scale value to 220 just because you know if this is 100 you can see that you know you can see these black spaces around so just set this to 220 just so that it gets covered when it's spinning and the last thing that we are going to do is uncheck this use compositions shutter angle and change the shutter angle to like 250 so now this actually is um, you know this effect is actually you know it's on a load to the um, CPU or the render engine so I'll simply uh, tap I on my keyboard here and go here and type tap O on my keyboard so that we render only this particular portion so um, go to the sequence and click on this render into out so Adobe Premiere Pro will start rendering out each one of the frame between these two videos and give us the output. Alright, so once this is done, uh, Premiere Pro will start playing the video just like this. So this is how our transition is going to happen. And this is how you make a spin transition between two videos you can add a, a spin sound effect I'll attach this project file for your reference in the description below and uh, I hope you like this video and if that's the case give us a thumbs up and uh, if you'd like to talk with me regarding visual effects and video editing you can always connect with me on Instagram at VFX guy Ravi and uh, Mr. Zebo, would you like to add something? Subscribe for more tutorials. Alright, so see you guys next time with another tutorial.